everyone, I'm Chris from Coffee and Metal, and we are here at the legendary Brave by Brave. What the hell? What the... I own this. What the hell is this? What the hell? Well, hey, guys. What the hell, guys? My name is Kristen. I am with Coffee and Metal, and here we have Warpath. What's up? What's up? Good. Warpath. Thanks for having us. You know, gonna be a bitchin' show tonight. All right. Would you like to introduce yourselves, boys? Uh, my name is Harrison Whitecloud. I play lead guitar in Warpath. My name is Chance Perez. I'm lead vocals and rhythm guitar. Dino Suna, play the drums. Warpath. And would you like to come closer, or do you want me to come to you, sir? How you doing? I'm Danny Trujillo, play bass for Warpath. All right. And I have a few questions for you boys. Who is Warpath and what is your history? Well, um, our whole history started actually all the way back in 2014 when we were still trying to figure stuff out. And it was me, this guy, and this guy, and our friend 
Shane Monahan playing bass at the time, and then that like didn't do anything for a couple of years, and then resurfaced just last year. We've only really been playing together like real gigs for a year, and um, been just hitting it hard here at Brick by Brick. A couple out of county shows. A couple out of county shows. Yeah. Malone's up we in did, uh, Santa Ana. Yeah, and then uh, we're looking to go in the studio here pretty soon. That's what we have, amazing. we see what we have different than most bands out there is we have a Native American feel. Everybody's related in the band, and we dress like the Native American. We are Native American, and we sing about the Native American. So it's a real good niche to be in this business and have this, you know, to present to everyone. You know, everyone's real into what's going on with us right now, so it's kind of cool. All right, all right, and here's the next one. Uh, next question. What are the lyrics about? Um, mostly native issues. And just, I mean, that's pretty much what the like most the, uh, the, the, What is it, the No Dapple up there in North Dakota? We have one for that. We have one okay. for that. Um, yeah. um, most of it is just uh, native issues tied to um, not only American society, but the rest of the world and how it affects everybody else. And yeah. so not just us, you know, taking it in everyone account. All right. Why the makeup? Would we like to go to this one? Who's getting it done? <laughs> Why the makeup? Yeah. <laughs> We're representing our war paint. We're going to war tonight. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Apparently it's a battlefield out there on stage. It it's a battlefield is. on stage. It's it a definitely. battlefield in this industry. And it's about a show. We want to give a show to these people. We want to entertain these people. It's not just up there jamming around, you know. We've got something to say. We want you to look at us while we're saying it, and this is one way to get it across. For sure. It's Native American War Paint. If you guys go on Warpath's Facebook page, Warpath Official. Warpath Official. I give uh, every couple days updates on Native American culture, the war paint, what colors represent, everything. So go to Warpath Official on Facebook and check it out. For sure. So you're also a learning experience. Absolutely. That's brilliant. Absolutely. And when we do release our CD. We're going to add some literature and some pictures in there that reflect the history as it's not told by the general population and the way it actually went down. So that's, that's who Warpath is. That's what we represent. I love that. All right. Do you guys know where you're going to be playing next? Uh, end of the year. End of the year show. Pro most likely at Waypoint Saloon in, in Ramona. Ramona. Yeah. But if another one pops up. Just hit us up on Facebook or Instagram, and we'll be sure we'll respond, to respond. Always, always. Yeah. We got plenty of merch. We got a little CD coming out. With you know, you can get some of our stuff. You can get our stuff on Reverb Nation. All right. And where can we find more of your music? Reverb Nation. Basically, just there. Yeah, pretty much. Also, also SoundCloud. SoundCloud. Yeah. SoundCloud. Do you post anything on Facebook or YouTube? We do some small clips of like practice and a little bit of this yeah. for recording or mixing down stuff. You live we'll throw it out. Some shows. Okay. We've got a Warpath uh, YouTube page here, please. Yeah. Yeah, we got Warpath. it. Warpath. Go to Warpath, Warpath on YouTube. Okay. Warpath official, and you'll come up with some some live gigs that we've got. All right. Thank you, boys. I cannot wait to see you guys on stage again. Right on. Thank you. Thanks, Chris. All right. So Bye, boys. <laughs>
from Coffee Metal, and I am here with DRI. Would you guys like to introduce yourselves? I am Spike. Monster. Greg. And our fourth one is off talking to some lovely ladies. <laughs> it curts around the corner. We can smell them. <laughs> Such love. <laughs> All right. I have a couple questions for you guys. So cool with answering? All right. Maybe. Maybe. Ooh. Ooh, goodness. We'll see. <laughs> We'll take it as it comes. Okay, I'm okay with this. <laughs> you, you guys stayed, and that's very kind of you. All right, uh, first question, how does it feel to be back in San Diego? We love San Diego. As you can tell by the show tonight, <laughs> it was awesome, sold out. We have good crowds here. It was crazy. I same was as last time, same as last time. Last time was sold out, too. Great yeah, show. Awesome. and Good energy. Yeah, it's awesome. For sure. All right. What was the last time you played here? Two years ago, right? Years. October 26th or tw 23rd. Damn, he's good at this. October 23rd, 2016. Damn. At uh, 11.35 p.m. we started, and we put, no, I don't know, just kidding. <laughs> I, don't wish, I can't remember shit like this. I can't do that. I'm bad at this. He's got the business sense over here, this guy. <laughs> business, all business. All right, so, uh, where are you guys headed to next? Los Angeles. Oh, you're Big show crazy tomorrow crap. with a bunch of uh, other Old bands. School. We're playing with XL Ooh. and Hyrax. Yeah. Why did we go to this one? Why didn't we go to the other one? And, and <laughs> Witch Haven. Yeah. And our support oh, act that's on tour with us, Death Wish. Yeah. Ooh. Awesome. It's going to be an awesome show. That's sold out as well, and that place holds like a thousand plus people. Oh my yeah, God, it's gonna this is going to be crazy. Wild. A little bummed that No's not going to play because it would have been nice to see Brandon and the fellas. I'm real bummed because I set up all these shows for them and then they just canceled. Uh. Brandon. <laughs> Don't ever ask me again. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. No, he's not. <laughs> Do you guys have any plans for 2018? For what? Yeah. 2018. Any plans? Yeah. Oh, oh, something's Make staring. it through that year. Ooh. <laughs> I think he's got some stuff in the works right now, so that'll be nice. We're, we're going to South America. Ooh, that should be fun. For the first time in a while. Um, we are having a, a, a tour in Europe and the UK. Ooh. And, of course, all over the United States and Canada again. Yeah. So, that should be a fun one. Uh, it's basically the same thing we always do, except we're taking a little extended break for winter vacation. Understandable. And then uh, back, back at it. Okay, um, it's been 10 years since you guys released your last album. Is there gonna be a new one in the makes? Because I know you guys released it. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I've been I'm in his ear this. about it. That's just, you know. I have no idea. What do you, I don't think we're ever gonna write another song, especially if Walter keeps asking me every day. Uh, uh, so I'm gonna make it twice a day now. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> he, can't, he can't escape the issue, I'm just saying. Well, during this we big have, break, you know, we, we got coming up, we, yeah. we can work on some songs a little yeah. bit, but we really don't have much time to do that, yeah. to, to work in the meantime, so we're, we're just touring all the time, and when we go home, we... Sleep. Sleep, right. <laughs> and I know so, uh, we're, we're going to start working a little bit in the beginning of next year, and uh, <clears throat> I don't know if we can wait long enough to, to write enough songs for an album we might just do another ep and start doing eps every once in a while that's and then we could take them all and like put them together and make an album i think fans would love that re-release it as an album i, I don't know we'll, see, like we'll see we'll see i think it's dope because i played with a lot of cool different people or whatever and he's just got like this own different style you know it's very unique and we just fucking rock together man even when we're just fucking around with sound checking and Light shit, checks. me and him come up with killer <laughs> shit together. We just got a good vibe together, man. We're like retarded brain together. Like, I'm the retarded part, he's the brain. <laughs> but we rock together, it's ill. So I just, I'm excited about it. That's why I keep giving him shit about it. Cause he's, I just think we're gonna, it'll be nasty. I'm sure it'll be great in every form of the song way. <laughs> All right. How does it feel after so long, um, after a long, trajectory to be a band that has influenced so many others like how does it feel just in, knowing that you influence so many other people out there 
it, it, it's awesome, of course. And you know, um, it's I don't know. It's it's been a while since we've influenced people. I think so. It, it it's kind of old news for us or whatever. <laughs> and and, you know, and we don't think like about that. that anymore, you know. But um, you really changed a generation with your music and your style. Like I remember growing up and seeing your stuff everywhere. Well, they definitely influenced me personally because I remember, like I told them all the time, I remember exactly where I was when I first heard the record. I remember who I was with. I remember going, Jesus, this is fucking sick, you know, because it was so brutal at the time. And I was like, wow, man. And then, I mean, shit. It, it's really cool that people come up yeah. and, and tell us this all the time and yeah. everything. And it, it, it's a bit overwhelming, but you, you have to kind of just take it in stride or else you wind up like Harold. <laughs> Lovely But boss. since I've been in the band... Just kidding, Harold. <laughs> just kidding. Right, thank you. We so, love you. <laughs> so since I've been in the band, I've been noticing that their fans are brutally loyal. They and really they'll bring us, generations yes. in. Like, we have a guy will, like have a son and he'll school his son on DRI and his son will grow up loving it and then he'll have a kid and it's just I seen like three or four generations one That's time pretty the show. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. it was dope alright I have one last question because I have a few friends out there who have no idea who you are what do you gotta say to these guys what do you <laughs> wanna say right. to them <laughs> yeah just come out and with and the dirty rotten embassies come out and experience it come to a show get in the pit have a great time fucking yeah, it's 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 fun. You know? We're all about having fun, enjoying yeah. the show, thrashing hard, kicking <laughs> ass, man, getting sweaty. Yep. No, really, I never realized that there was sweat in there. It totally yep. wasn't a climate change. Mm -hmm. His glasses totally didn't fog up upon entering. <laughs> That's <laughs> awesome. You got windshield here. wipers on your fucking <laughs> glasses, bro. <laughs> it's all good. Well, thank you guys. It was great. I <laughs> loved the show, and I can't wait to see you guys again. Awesome. Thank you for having us. Thank you, guys. Awesome. We love you, and we'll see you next Thanks time. Thanks for the support, everybody. Yes. <laughs> yes.